Yes, us folks, it's puppy hour. Have a look. They're right there. And Vader's tormenting. Which one's Vader? That's Vader. Hey, what are you doing? Hey. All right, Cara, sit now. Good girl. <laughs> he likes, um, well, I was going to say lamb chop, but that's not a lamb, is it? <laughs> There we go. Oh, the love. All right, puppy hour. We'll do gardening in a second, folks. There we are. Okay, so this is what happens every day. Now, last year I sowed my seeds really early, and many of you who follow me, I cooked them, basically fried them, or frostbite, that is. This year, I'm going to give it another go, and I'm going to, I've, I've upped the ante here. I've gone all out this time on the same hot house, but I've got the new coating on it. This is what we call double glazing, but on a cheap side. Bubble wrap, folks. Now, if you know about double glazing, you know that little air pocket between the two sheets of plate or glass is where the cold air gets through and gets captured into that pocket there. So then on the inside, you get less air, much less cold air getting through. Well, it's not air, but the actual temperature. So having a double glaze, you reduce the amount of cold air getting inside. And that's what I've done with the bubble wrap. I wasn't going to put two layers of glass or plastic, but rather bubble wrap and box tape. <laughs> if it rains, I hope it stays together. But anyway, we're going to give it a go. Is it hot? It's hot. It's very warm, actually. Now, I've sown, I've sown three trays. I've got my big giant gorilla heat mat underneath here, folks, but I'm using these extra large trays. These aren't for sale, so don't ask me for them. But what I've got in here is the little malakas, big malakas. We've got big malaka 1.3 kilos and a 900 gram. And these are also little malakas here. So we've got a three, 400 um, uh, seeds of each variety. This big malaka is a 2.4 kilo batch. So everyone who, well, first in first serve, basically, these will be made available later on. Back to the topic of heat, the heat map. It's, what's it sitting at now? 19.9 degrees. That's in here. I have actually haven't set, this is my thermostat, have a look. This is my little thermometer. This measures the temperature in here, so it's at 19.9. Let's see what happens when I take it outside, where it's cooler. Is it going to drop? Yes, it is. See, it's dropping, so it's active in real time. So we need this room to be around 19 degrees. Now, outside here at the moment, I checked on my phone, it was about 9 degrees. So 10 degrees in here, meaning the bubble wrap works. It will work for you too. So if you've got a mini hothouse um, or just a little hothouse like that, one of those little simple ones, portable ones, or just sort of pop-up ones, see if you can put a double glaze on it. And the cheapest way to do it is with bubble wrap. And that's what I'm doing now. Mate of mine, Craig, as you all know very well, did that with his eggplant. I need to ask him how it's going because he's trying to save it through the winter period, especially the last couple of nights of frost. Now, last night we had minus three degrees here on our property. Uh, tonight we're going to be sitting around seven or eight degrees that's a forecast so this here if it's nine degrees outside it's 19 degrees inside it's going to be 18 degrees at night time so it's perfect it's perfect for the plants and the soil won't be up to 18 degrees it'll be sitting probably around 14 or 15 but the little secret you're going to hate me for this i'm going to say it but you're going to hate me see the thin layer of plastic that we got here so the insulation on this is very minimal, okay? So what you do with these, you sit them in the heat, uh, the, the hothouse, I haven't got one here, the hothouse base. So that sits in another base and creates the air pocket. Got the idea? So the, the, the bottom part captures the cold and stops it from transferring into here. Then you put the lid on top of that. So that's your mini hothouse. But by comparison to this one here, have a look at the thickness here. So the thickness of the wall there, what's that, about three or four mil? That's, you'd be lucky if that's one mil. So that insulation, that thickness is an extra coating of insulation which captures the heat and stores it inside and protects the soil much better. Therefore, the seeds should germinate a lot easier. These were only sown yesterday. I've only had the heat, out, heat matter on from last night or actually early this morning. It was almost two o'clock or three o'clock in the morning, folks. So these did experience a cold night last night and I'm hoping they germinate. That's as simple as that. So if you're going to get ready for springtime, now's the time to start sowing your seeds. You can wait a little bit longer if you like, but remember, we're already in August. I didn't sow these in June or July. I sowed them in August, the first week of August. So it is later than last year. And if you haven't got a nice warm spot, get yourself a mini hothouse. They're available online. Get yourself a heat mat, the giant heat mat. Look at this. It holds over the three large trays. 
These are the smaller trays and it'll sit for four trays quite comfortably on a giant heat mat or simply just the normal size. Set it up, create the ambient temperature that they need because you need to get the soil right as far as the temperature is concerned and the rest is up to nature. If you're looking for a seedling tray like this folks, send us a message. I'll see how many people are really interested in them and I'll hunt them down and see if I can get them online for you guys to be able to grow them at home, just like the pros do. So this is the professional level. If when I go to that stage, send a message, we'll see what we can do and hopefully we'll all be able to grow bigger, better, beautiful flower, fruit and vegetables. That's all it is. Vasilisgarden.com, everything you need, discounted every day. Our get ready to spring sale is still on, so use the coupon code word READY to get a 25% off your favourite product. From Eva Silly, Maresi.